Okay, hi guys, I'm Peter. And I'm Roxy. Okay, so for today's video, uh, we're doing uh, something a bit more different, a bit different from what we usually do on our channel. So as, it, as you can see from the title, we are showing you guys uh, some of the card game and anime related stuff that we got uh, on our trip to Japan this year. Uh, honestly, we didn't get much. Right. Uh, Roxy did get some manga, but uh, should we show the manga? Oh, it's fine. I think it's fine. Uh, it's basically, what's that anime? What's Blue that manga? Exorcist. Black? Okay, sorry. Blue Exorcist manga. So maybe we'll show a picture here. But basically, for the main thing that we're going to be showing you guys today uh, will be this and this. So this is uh, My Hero Academia uh, Trump cards, playing cards. So they're based off My Hero Academia characters. Yes. So, so you can see the price tag still there. <laughs> and then I myself got two packets of this. Two packs of these are uh, Detective Pikachu TCG uh, movie boosters, I think. I think that's what they're called. Uh, to open up as well for you guys okay so before we get into this uh, we will have a look at some of the other tcg related stuff that i got so i actually got myself two deck boxes uh in japan so this is a pokemon theme deck box deck box or deck case between the three starters for the new uh for pokemon uh sword and shield so there's grookey there's core bunny and then that's sobble over there so i thought it looked cool and i was um Decking deck boxes as well for my decks, so I might as well pick up a few deck boxes to store my cards and to store uh, decks that I'm going to build uh, in the future. Right, it's pretty cool. And then at the side, you can see here uh, all the current Pokemon types. So we have Grass, Fire, Water, Lightning, Psychic, uh, Normal, Fighting, Dark, Metal, Fairy, and Dragon. And that's the seal. Right. Okay. So put that aside, and then I got one of these generic deck boxes. Uh, I don't know why it says there, I can't read Japanese, maybe Roxy can. No? Okay, it's fine. Yep, okay. Just to store my cards. So it's a clear one, uh, it has Velcro on it, so I'm not a big fan of Velcro deck boxes, but just thought I might as well just give it a try. Since they are, they are cheap, I think. It's a bit noisy outside, it's okay. And then I got myself uh, one of these uh, 80... 80 card sleeves thing so i think these are um buddy fight sized or pokemon card sized so they are bigger than vanguard size so uh, i think they they will make for good like double sleeves uh if i ever want to yeah so they have 80 um 80 card sleeves as i've mentioned so just enough for one deck and i will have about 30 leftovers maybe for gifts or what whatever and the brand is a class there so not sure about the quality, but they were cheap, so I just got them. And now let's get to the main attraction. So I'm going to open up these two packs first, and then we'll get into the My Hero Academia Trump cards, which are really interesting looking. So let's just start with the Detective Pikachu packs. So Detective Pikachu, uh, I'm sure most of you guys already know about this movie. came out this year, 2019. Today is the last day of 2019, the day I'm filming this video. So, yep, the end of a decade. But, in, but anyways, um, Detective Pikachu came out on May, I think, in May, came out in May, worldwide. So, pretty interesting movie, uh, you guys should definitely watch if you're interested, if you like Pokemon. Right. And for this uh, movie, it was a live action movie, so basically everything was realistic, including the uh, Pokemon here. As you can see, we have the realistic looking Charizard, with the scaly skin, that's Mewtwo, with Bulbasaur, Jigglypuff, Magikarp, that's Pikachu, the fuzzy Pikachu, Detec Detective Pikachu, and then that's Greninja there. So these are Japanese cards, uh, obviously, because we bought them in Japan. And I think they were released quite some time ago as well. So one pack includes four cards, right? And the cards will feature like scenes from the movie, if I'm not wrong. So SRs, dub double rares, uncommons, and commons. Okay. Yep, for sale in Japan, only made in Japan. Okay, let's start opening them. So first time opening Pokemon cards on my channel. It's been a while, so I may not remember all the Pokemon names. Oops, we just destroyed the pack. <sighs> Gotta keep them clean. Okay, let's put that pack aside. And let's start 
Oh yeah, I heard that all the cards are actually foiled. So start off first with an Arcanine. It's really cool looking. Okay. Right, we have a magic card here. Don't know if you guys can see the shine. Right. right. We have Licky Tongue. Looks interesting. Whoa. Like this uh, metallic look, metallic foil. Let's have a, let's have a look at the uh, zooming in. Uh, look at the artwork closer. Can you see that slimy tongue or flicky tongue? Alright, and then the last card should be the rarer card, I think. Not exactly sure about the rarity. But we get Detective Pikachu. Yes. Alright. So at least we got Detective Pikachu. So, not bad. It's an uncommon. Oh, it's an uncommon. Okay, so Roxy is looking at the card list right now. So it's an, so it's an uncommon. Uh, I think every pack comes with three commons and one un uncommon or above. Something like that. Yep. So I only got two packs. Uh, they were cheap, but um, they were Japanese. I think we have the English versions as well in sale, on sale. Somewhere, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Second pack. So as you can see, they're all like shiny. So you can see my reflection there. My, my reflection on my hand there. Anyway, so let's go back to the second pack. Start off first with... Um, if I'm not wrong, this is the champ. So he's like a police... Uh, what do you call it? The traffic police. Right. This, this is the scene from the movie. Pretty interesting. Yeah, my champ. Uh, is he a common or...? Common. Right. We have Psyduck. Okay. Oh, what's that at the top? Oh, it's just a scene in the movie, alright. <laughs> okay. Not sure how clear these... The, the, the picture is off for you guys, because Pokemon cards are not full art. Not all of them are full art, so... It's a bit hard to show you guys the artwork. I'm not really used to it. But this is Arcanine again. And then our uncommon card is Charizard. I think that's pretty decent. We did get Det uh, Detective Pikachu and Charizard. So two cards that feature on the uh, pack packaging and two like classic cards, classic Pokemon as well. Oh, that's nice. Really like Char I really like Charizard. Really interesting card. Really interesting Pokemon. Alright, so yep, that's it for the um, Two pack opening for Detective Pikachu packs, Japanese packs. All of them are shiny, better sleeve them up later on. Right, just put these cards aside and let's get into the My Hero Academia Trump cards. So we got the price tag there, I don't mind that. But let's have a look at the characters. Alright, Roxy, do you want to join me? Okay, so Roxy was the one who introduced me to My Hero Academia. And since then, I've liked the uh, anime quite a bit. Because I'm a big fan of superheroes and they all have like their own superpowers and stuff like that. Alright, so uh, shall we take out the packaging first? Do we have a scissors here? Mm. Okay, let's cut it here. So, not sure how legit this are, right? They seem pretty legit, so. Uh, Let's have a look at the packaging before we get into the cuts. But anyways, uh, this is the brand I think, and Sky. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go. So let's try to name all the characters. Okay, so we have uh, All Might there. We have Todoroki to to his left. And then this is the main character, the protagonist. Izuku. Yes, Izuku. That's uh Roxy. <laughs> Just kidding. That's Ochako. <laughs> That's Bakugo. And as you can see, uh, they are all playing cards. So, for example, here, Izuku Midoriya is uh, Ace of Spades. And then Katsuki Bakugo is uh, Queen of Spades. All Might there is uh, King of Hearts. Oh, we have Tanya there. Two of Hearts. And then Todoroki is Ashoto, is Four of Spades. Okay, up there, we have more characters. 
So maybe Roxy would like to name them. Kaminari, yes. Hiroshima, Zuyu, Takayami, and Mezo. Yes, and then, oh, we forgot about her. Oh, Hagakure. Yep, the invisible girl. Alright, up there we have um, the grape hero, Mineta, yes. Alright, the back, more pictures of what of the cards that we're going to be seeing inside here. Alright, this feels like a trial deck, but it's not a trial deck. Yeah, it's very interesting. Uh, we have a razor hit at the top, or might, of course, spitting blood, as always. And these are the, uh, these are the guys, so you guys can see clearly. So very interesting. Uh, can't wait to get it open. Oh, what's this? Age limit. So I think the target age group is six years and above. All right, poker cuts. Let's go. Oh yeah, in the sights. So we have uh, Zuyu and Kirish uh, Kirishima. Kirishima. That's right. That's right. And Kirishima. <laughs> okay, let's let's get it. Ah, my Hero Academia. But that side, oh, okay, so I just saw this. Um, the full bodies, or rather half of the bodies, it's been, uh, is underneath, if you, if you know what I mean. So, whoa, nice, this looks really cool. Okay, it's a bit oily though. <laughs> but, oh, is it sealed? Oh, yeah, it is sealed. All right, all right. So, so in the packaging, they covered this, so we didn't know. It will come like spread. Um, uh, where is it? Scotch tips, yeah. Alright. So today's video is just a calming video. No match videos. But it's okay, we'll resume match videos um next year. <laughs> yep. Alright. So put that aside. So I think I'll show this side and Roxy will show that side. Or oh, I can show this side, yeah. I'll just show that side. So very nice packaging. Uh you can always store your cards in here, I guess. You just put them back in and then put that put them back into the uh, actual packaging. Because I don't think you really sleeve trump cards, right? But the artwork looks really nice and I think I might actually just sleeve them up. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna show this side first. So we have the ace of spades. So all these are the spades, alright? So, this is Izuku Midoriya, our protagonist here. Love this guy. Okay, so as we've mentioned, Two of Space is Tenya. Three of Space is Minoru. So I'm not sure whether it's just... Are they going to feature like all the characters from one or just a few? Like just those that we see on the box. So it'd be good if they feature everyone, but if not, then it's fine. Uh, still nice to have such merchandise. So that's Shoto Todoroki from Mikage Tokiyami. Oh, nice. Aoyama. Oh, we have Mina. Okay. Kyoka Jiro, one of Roxy's favorite characters. <laughs> Hero Spades. Uh, Nine of Spades is Koji Koda. So I think they're actually going to feature everyone. Oh, nice. Ten of Spades is Toru Hagakure. And ooh, Jack of Spades. To you, as we. Yeah, joke. Uh, no, no, Jack, Jack. It's not a joke. Yeah. yeah. The Queen of Spades is Katsuki Bakugo. Okay. King of Spades, All Might. And then... That's about it. Oh, the Jokers are somewhere else, right? Yeah. Alright, so the, those are all the uh, Spade characters. Put them aside. Let's move on to Hearts. So I think it's going to be like all the same. So it's going to be just these few characters. I don't know. Is it... There's Ochako. Oh yeah, there's Ochako. We're missing Ochako, Kaminari, Kirishima, and um, any more guys up there. Have you seen him? No. No. And of course, a few more other guys like Momo. Like Momo. And Mikido. I think that's about all that we can remember off, our, off the top of our heads for now, but let's get into it. Uh, the hearts. So Let's same guys. Oh yeah, Eraser hit as well. So, so these are these are the same guys, and I think the artwork is the same as well. Oh no, it is different. It's actually different. Yeah. So this is uh his school uniform, right? Yeah. And then this is Shoto in his battle hero costume. Hero costume. Oh wait, are these the hero costumes? Yeah. yeah, these are the hero costumes. Oh, that looks really cool. 
So these are the civilian clothes and these are the uh, hero costumes. So there's the diaper guy. Right. Oh, I see your chocolate at the back. That's a rare. I'm just kidding. Yes, this guy. Whoa, nice. It's like a knight. Okay. Hope you guys can see it clearly. Um, same thing. Yeah. Chaco Uraraka. Oh yeah, actually we've seen a Chaco. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So these are the pumped up, passionate artwork of um, Chaco and Izuku. It's all mine again. Katsuki again. And oh wait, these are the diamond cuts. Yeah. Oops, we just trespassed into Roxy's pile, but that's okay. Yep. Now Roxy will show you guys the other part, the other half. But uh, before that, let's have a look at the back. So you see the um, more like more popular ones. Are they the more popular ones? I'm not sure. Probably, probably the like the more main ones, the ones more associated with him with uh, Izuku. Right. So Roxy will show you guys the second half. Let's go. Okay. Ooh. So first we have Tuyu, and then um. Kirishima. Oh, nice. Kirishima. Let's have a closer on Kirishima. First time we see him. Right, not bad. Hard looking. Kaminari. Yes. Momo. Oh, yes, Momo. Yeah, just steal the hand. Mezo. Okay. Really like the fox. Oh, yeah, Sero. Rikido. Okay, we have Hulk. Oh, oh Jiro. We forgot about Machine Rao. Okay, we have a mm. Minoru, Minoru Mineta running away from something. Nice. Tenya. Speedy Tanya. All Might again. And now we have the Ace of Clubs, Bakugo. Oh, are these the civilian clothing for those yeah. that we haven't seen them in civilian clothing? I think so, yeah. Ochako. Tsuyu. Kirishima. Kirishima, yes. Kaminari. Okay. Momo. Mezo. No. Okay. Sero. Okay. Sato. Rikido Sato. Yeah, and then Ojiro. Mm. Kirishima. Nice, he's featured on this one of these passionate cards. Todoroki. Yes, of course. All Might. Oh, the, and the weakened and version the of Jokos. All Might. Jokos. Oh, yeah, the Jokos. Eraser Head. Oh, okay, so it's Eraser Head. Then we have the Spitting All Might. All Might Spitting Blood. <gasps> Two blank cards for Roxy and I. So this is going to be Roxy, and that's going to be me. <laughs> Time to design our own card, DIY. Yes, DIC, I guess. All right, so that's it. Um, sad that we only got one eraser head. I was hoping to see like, wait, is that the only eraser head that we got? Yeah. Yep. So really interesting trump cuts, uh, poker cuts, whatever you want to call them. They call them trump cuts in Japan, right? Yeah. Okay, so yep. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, showcasing of stuff that we got. Um, in Japan. These are obviously not all that we got in Japan. Uh, we also got like many many other things. Like for example this Kuroko no Basuke. Uh the man who plays Kuroko. Sorry the the basketball which Kuroko plays. I'm actually not sure what this is. I haven't really opened it up but very nice looking. And we also got a lot of food, a lot of Kit Kat, stuff like that. So uh, these two blank cards, really nice. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this uh, opening. And bye guys. <laughs> Have a wonderful last day of 2019. And we'll see you guys next year, 2020. Next decade. Next, yes, next decade, 1st of January. And let's have a last look at Detective Pikachu over here. And bye guys. Yeah, I forgot to mention is that I also got this um, Katsuki Bakugo uh, badge or some, some, sort of, some sort of thing like that. I think it's a badge from a uh, vending machine in Japan as well. It's pretty interesting.
It's cool. Not sure why there's snowflakes on the side. <laughs> oh, and the uh, Roxy also got this um, Kuro badge from Haikyuu. Right. So I think he's the captain of uh, Nekoma, if I'm not wrong. Yep, from, an from another vending machine. So it looks cool. Alright, Happy New Year guys.